Hello, my name is Eric Gregori from EMG Robotics, and this is the um, audio dual motor controller board based robot tank. Here you can see the board right there. The tank is designed, of the actually the audio dual motor control board is designed to be run from a smartphone. Uh, in fact, it can actually be run from anything with an audio jack. In this case, I want to describe how to use RFO Basic from Paul Lawton to control the robot. This is a port of Basic that uh, Paul has written for the Android phone. Uh, he's made it open source and I've modified the basic slightly so it can control the audio dual motor control board. So we're going to go ahead and select the icon. And so after opening the basic interpreter on the phone, what you have is this really nice editor. And you can go through and you can scroll through your code. I've written a little application here. You type it right in on your phone. It's got a nice built-in editor. And you can see here, what I'm using to control the robot is this tone command. The robot itself, via the headphone jack, is controlled by audio tones. So to go forward, you give it one tone, turn you give it another tone so in theory any uh, application that runs on a phone uh, or, or any computer really that can generate audio tones can control this robot so I just typed in a simple little program it's gonna go forward turn right forward turn right basically to do a square so then I'm gonna go ahead and click a little menu up here and I'm gonna run the program Now the tones you're hearing is because I do not have the headphone jack plugged in. When I plug in the headphone jack, those same tones will control the robot. So I've mounted the phone now on the robot. I'm going to go ahead and plug the audio jack in. So you can see the audio jack is now plugged in. So the robot audio jack plugs into the audio jack on your smartphone. And you can see there's my basic program. I'm going to go to the menu. And I'm going to type, I'm going to move the car over here a little bit. And I'm going to type run. Hopefully it doesn't fly off the table. There it goes. Scoot it a little bit. So this RFO basic can actually do a lot more than just simple uh, activities like that.